What's up, it's Andy with My Tech Methods, and this video is going to show you how to back up your iPhone, your iPad, or your iPod to your computer using iTunes, and this works on a Mac or a Windows PC. Before we get into this video, I just want to remind you real quickly, hit that subscribe button right below this video, that way you're kept up to date with all my newest videos. So backing up your iPhone, your iPad, or your iPod is a pretty fairly basic task, but I get a lot of questions about it, so I figured I'd go ahead and do a video over it for you guys. So there are two main ways to back up your iPhone or whatever iOS device you have. I'll just refer to it as an iPhone for this video's sake. Uh, the one way is to go on your phone, your iPhone itself, and go to Settings, iCloud, and Backup. As long as you're connected to a Wi-Fi connection, you can back up your iPhone through iCloud as long as you have an iCloud account which you should and you can do it that way and that backs up your iPhone through iCloud without even connecting it to a computer the second way is what I do and uh, what most people do is backing up their iPhone to their computer using iTunes so I'm going to show you that today the first thing you want to do is open up iTunes on your computer then connect your iPhone to your computer using the USB cable now most likely it'll automatically back up your iPhone when you connect it so if you click on your iPhone in the devices list over here on the left hand side if you look here at the latest backup you can see when it when it backed up the last the most recent backup was on your computer and you can see that it automatically backs up my iPhone whenever I connect it so if yours doesn't do that to manually back it up you just choose this backup now button right here or you can go up to file devices and then back up Either way, they both do the same thing. They both will back up your iPhone to your computer. And if you want to view a list of recent backups, just go up here to the preferences and then go to devices. And you can see all the backups that it has on your computer, stored on your computer. And you can see mine uh, have three backups stored and the most recent was just right now. If you want to see where these backups are stored on your computer, you just right click, right click and then sh choose show in finder if you're on a Mac or show in Windows Explorer if you're on a Windows PC and it will open up the folder I don't know why you would want to go in here and look it's just all gibberish but um, yeah there it is it's right there in a random folder and as long as it's getting backed up to your computer that's all you really care about now what is all included in the backup when it backs up to your computer well pretty much everything that is not in iTunes is backed up to your computer. Now what I mean by that is your music, your movies, your TV shows, your podcasts, your books, apps, and your ringtones in here in iTunes, they're already in iTunes. So those don't get backed up to that backup folder. Now what does get backed up is your camera roll, your saved photos on your phone, your text messages, your iMessages, your contacts, your calendar, all your settings and app data. All that stuff gets backed up. That's included in your on, on your iPhone backup. And I'll put a link in the video description below to the iTunes website where it just lists everything that's included in these iTunes backups whenever you back up your iOS device. But everything else, as far as your music, your movies, TV shows, all that stuff, your apps, that's already here in iTunes. So that doesn't get backed up. Now, if you want to restore an iPhone, iPad, or iPod to one of your backups, all you have to do is connect that iOS device to your iTunes. And then once it's connected, go to File devices and then restore from backup and you can choose from your most recent backups from that list that we saw earlier so that's pretty much it guys that's how to back up your iphone ipod or ipad to your mac computer or your windows computer works on both as long as you have itunes as you can see it's very easy to do but now you know how to go in there and check to see if it is getting backed up and where that backup is located i hope this helped you out if you have any questions just leave a comment in the comment section below and i will try my best to get back to you and thank you so much for watching keep having fun out there and i will talk to you later